What's up guys, welcome to another video. I'm just going to cover in this one the best tweaks that you can put into your system and the easiest way to set a stretch resolution so you can get the best performance in all your games, be it Fortnite, Valorant, Rocket League, Minecraft, Roblox, Tetris, whatever you play. Essentially, this will cover all the best settings that you can have on your computer that will optimize your gaming. Essentially, it'll make your $20 laptop into the performance of a $500 PC or a $2,000 PC. Obviously, capping there, it's not actually going to be that good, but it'll heavily increase your FPS and decrease your ping. That, they're the main two things. That being said, if you like this video, feel free to hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps me out a ton, and let's get into it. Alright, 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 alright. In this tweaks folder is all the settings and apps that you can run. First of all, I'm going to get into filter key setter. Essentially, the best settings for this are a repeat delay of around 120 to 130. Ignore under has to be zero because that way it takes in every single keystroke that you make on your keyboard and won't miss any. And the repeat delay, I don't know how much it matters, but around 20 to 30 is what you should look at. And then at the end of it, you've got to make sure you click save to registry and apply. Test it out if you feel like you need to, but for the most part, those settings should be fine. Essentially, that'll just make your keyboard strokes go a lot faster than they normally would. It'll count from pretty much the moment that the key is activated. It'll go straight to your system, so it massively decreases your input delay. And then essentially, at the same time, it's decreasing your ping to simplify it. You can have this fully closed. Just click save to register, click, click apply, then close it. That's all good. Next, you have to have timer resolution. There'll be links in the description for all of these. Make sure this is set to 0.5 milliseconds. It may go 0.499. Make sure it's 0.5. It'll maximize the, it'll minimize the input delay of your monitor. This one you have to minimize though. As soon as you click apply, you have to minimize it. Otherwise it won't work. Alpha res, this is the easiest way to get stretch resolution on an Ada laptop or a cheap PC that doesn't have a great monitor. Just set it to the FPS that you have your games running at, set it to whatever stretch resolution you would like and make sure it's in windowed full screen or full screen, whatever you use in said games. Otherwise it just won't work for you. Make sure you click read only and click apply and you should be sweet. Next, we should be going into the last thing, which is TPC or TCP optimizer. This one didn't work properly for me in this video because I wasn't on my administrator account, but essentially all you want to do is make sure it's on the optimal settings and then just click apply changes, go through all the steps it tells you to do, usually tells you to restart your PC so it'll actually work for you, then click exit. Essentially, it will just optimize your Wi-Fi so that it minimizes your ping and it's just as effective, if not more effective, than no ping, exit lag, all those kind of things. Don't waste your money on this kind of stuff. This is free. Download it in the description and it just optimizes your games. That being said, I think that's all I needed to cover. They're the main four things that you should, five things that you should have running. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, once again, feel free to like and, like and subscribe, hit that ring, the no notification button, and that helps out your boy a lot, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.